there we go. What's up, what's up, what's up, everybody? It's Barbarisi. Got my bearings together. You know the name, and you know there's no game. You know it's all 100% authentic New York attitude. Yeah, the only kid born on Long Island, but it's all good. It's still New York, right? Family from the Bronx and Brooklyn and Jersey. And we got a little, little, little Weedy B drinking his water. He got his tablet. He's chilling like a motherfucking villain. The fuck you looking at, man? Keep it fucking moving, ass wipe. Beeping at me. Try again. You believe these motherfuckers? Beeping at Barbarisi. Like, honey. Yeah, Barbarisi is dressed to kill tonight, guys. I told you I was back. Ew, 41 years old in December. I'm fucking owning my shit. What? Yes, I'm humble. But the truth is the truth. God made us the way that we are for a reason. And people that have superior things at heart. It's about who you are in your heart. It's not about the exterior. That doesn't mean everything. That don't mean fucking anything. I just happen to be given a plus. So what? I'm given a plus and that's it. So fuck the noise like my uncle Deuce. Uncle Todd would say, fuck the noise. God made me like this and I'm owning who I am. You know what I'm saying? I'm like, wait a minute. Why am I gonna hold back? It's not that I'm showing off. No, this is what gifts, natural gifts. Look, watch this. Wanna see something? I ain't got no motherfucking teeth. You think that I'm not gonna show that too? Man, I don't give a fuck. That's just the way it is. You know, I have flaws. I got a lot of flaws. Man, if you seen my feet, honey, you'd run for the hills. I mean, I'm just being honest. Yeah, there's things about me that are good. And then there's things about me that are not good. And I'm not perfect. No way, no how. You know who's perfect? This. The children. Oh my God, look how cute he looks today. He's chilling. He's lounging, it's hot. Oh Lord, okay. So, what Barbarisi got? Trusty old Bado. He hasn't been out all day. Oh, excuse me, I'm wrong. He was out for a little uh, while earlier today with Tito while I was cleaning up, which is good. Cause you know, Tito's not working right now, not at fault of his own. You know, anyone who is losing work because of COVID, you know, more power to you, it's not your fault. Don't ever think that you're not doing the right thing for your family, because you, you are, you are, you know, you are. Because if you thinking how you're gonna put food on the table and trying the best you can to provide, whatever means possible, then you doing the right thing. You know, it's not like you sitting back saying, oh, God helps those who helps themselves. So it's not like you're like, okay, I'm just gonna sit back and wait for the friggin' dinner to appear on the table, no. God can do that, but that's not how it works. You know, you're supposed to work for what you have and people don't have jobs right now that's not their fault it's not and people have to understand that it's not their fault people have to understand that there's something in the making bigger than some bigger than what a regular person that's just doing a nine to five commuting driving getting stuck in traffic trying to pay their bills put food on the table everything was put on stop everything was put on pause you know what I'm saying that's not people's fault who are trying to do the right thing for their family you know and 
it's like you got to give it to the people who are still out of work. And then you got the president passing executive orders. And then you got unemployment turn around saying that shit don't mean nothing. You know, come on. They're playing games with people's lives here. There are people that have children. Children like Weedy B. That are hungry. God forgive me. Listen, people, listen to me. If you are somebody who is in need of anything, do not hesitate to ask me. I do not have a lot, but I will not say no. You know, I will try to do what I can to help anybody who's been stuck in a rut because of the situation. And I'm not just saying that. I mean that. I mean that with all of my heart because I, if you watch my earlier videos, you will see. Look at my baby. <laughs> oh, he's coming around my baby. <laughs> you will see that I always, always, always and there for the children, always praying for the kids, always wondering what's up for the kids. It's the children that come first. The children are our future. The children are our world. And without them, we have no future. And that's not a cliche, that's the truth. If you look back to the 1980s, I was born 79. When I was born and say, oh, when I grow up, I want to be a junkie. There was a commercial about that too. No, hopes, dreams, aspirations. Children have them, you know, and always trying to encourage them. Don't ever downtrod in their dreams. Even if it's something big, it doesn't matter. Try the best you can to encourage your kids because it could be that one time that you don't, that could have a huge impact on their life, a negative impact, and you don't want that. Believe me, I've been put down many times, many times as a child that I wish, I'm sorry guys, I'm walking real fast. It's humid as hell. You can cut the humidity with a butter knife, what shit, what a steak knife. Look at me, <laughs> He was just raising his hands like he was on a roller coaster ride. You want your baba, babe? Yes, my love, let me get to the other side of the street. Hold on, baby. Mama's got you. Hold on. Put the brakes on. Hold on, guys. Gotta give Weedy B his baba. Excuse me, look at that while I give him his bottle. Oh, honey! You want me to put on your um your show? Wait. Wait a second, baby. Hold on. Oh my goodness, guys, you spilled all this water. That's okay. Barbary Sea travels with a lot of water. Wait a second. mommy brought guys I brought this because he likes to watch his videos I'm sorry guys I'm trying to keep weedy B entertained hold on baby oh my god guys it is hot out here Lord holy crap wow huh yes okay we got connection boy guys I'm here you want to see Weedy B's mask look at this it's not as well will he wear it how yo you guys see how much I'm sweating Whew. lord I'm giving birth to water droplets literally so guys <gasps> Weedy just picked up one of his shoes I mean this is what it is to have a baby oh <gasps> Oh my god, no, Weedy B, no you didn't. 
Oh boy. Okay guys. Bob Reese has to backtrack. Lady B kicked off. Oh I got him both, guys! I got him both, look! Wait, my phone fell. You know, this is real life. He kicked off both the shoes. He's like, you know what, Ma? Look guys, I got both of the shoes. I'm not telling fairy tales, got both he kicked them both away. He's like, you know what, Ma? It's too hot out here. Hold on, baby. I'm spraying you down. Yes. I know. It's hot as a, it's hot as a month. Yes, Weedy B. I got you. Hold on. Let me put the brake on. Hold on, guys. Guys, you know me. I put Weedy B before my own thing. I got you, baby. Hold on. Swirl around and get back to where we were. Yes. Okay, guys. So you see my little my eyeglasses, my my celebration glasses. Yes. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> oh my God. Yes. It is I. It is me. What's up? Sweaty and all. My daughter gave me these earrings. Uh, my daughter gave me this shirt and my daughter gave me these pants. Oh my God. And Gia, if you're watching this, I'm not mentioning you anymore, baby. I'm not, but she gave me this outfit and I appreciate it. And I have the ring that I gave you. You left it behind, baby. I love you, girl. Mama, love you. I'm not ashamed. Mom, oh my God, look how beautiful that is. Look at this, guys. Well, I put my ring back on. You know what? You know, I have to say, God has given me, look, guys, you see my ring? It's like a dragon with a crystal ball and a dagger. Pop! Yeah, pop someone's eye out real quick with that one. And then I got my glitter changing bracelets. Gia, I gave you one of those too. And baby girl left them behind. It's all good. And mama is sweating like a friggin' pig. Oh my God, but I'll tell you one thing. People don't understand, when you sweat, you have to keep yourself hydrated because your body is cooling itself off. And if you do not replenish the electrolytes, or, yes, baby, oh my God, for some reason, guys, my phone keeps turning off. I don't know what it is about it, but yeah. Come here, baby. Okay. Oh my God, guys, I'm telling you, my, the phones that I have, it's upside down. I wish I had hold it like this. It's sweaty, it's hot. Yo, check out the weather in Manhattan. You will see that it is super duper humid. Oh my God, and the phone keeps dying out. Like what's, okay, I got to back up. Baby, mama got it, I got to back up guys. See, he's handing me this one. Back up. Back up. Wait. 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 Guys, for some reason, okay, so guys, I got a tablet. Hold on, I'm trying to move this. Guys, I am trying so hard. All right, let's just observe what Bob Reese is trying to do. Weedy B got this. He got this. And this is, I'm just trying to get to the park. 
okay it's not like I'm doing something wrong you know there's a lot of parents that try to give their kids oh my god I look like my niece try to give their kids like devices to distract them from doing their job guess what in the house I do not use devices I'm just trying to get to A to B and in the meantime if my son wants to watch something that's fine with me he don't want to look at the surrounding areas that's fine but in the house do I use these devices no I don't I play with my son hands-on and I interact with him pretty much 19 hours a day because you know what weedy B takes naps so long in the middle of the day sometimes weedy B is up I have to like start a schedule a schedule where he doesn't fall asleep in the middle of the night oh I'm sorry yeah where he sleeps in the middle of the night and stays awake predominantly in the daytime but he will wake up okay so this is sometimes it happens happenstance not it's not like I plan this so we need to wake up like three in the morning he'll fall asleep around eight o'clock he'll get up around one or two and be up and the same cycle and I try to keep him from doing that because that's not a good cycle crossing Look how smart he is, everyone. Look, he knows how to do it. He really does. Oh my God, he is so intelligent. I got it, I got it. Hold on, guys. You are too smart for your own good. Super duper sweaty. 